Well, good morning. Happy Wednesday. Hope your day is off to a great start so far. Welcome to Ozarks Fox AM. I'm Jeremy Rabe. And I'm Maddie Conklin. And what day of the week are we on? <laughs> Is it Ron Monday? Wednesday. Is it Friday? It's Wednesday. Oh, it's Wednesday, yeah. Yeah. Wait, when you said Monday, I actually second guessed myself. <laughs> oh, yeah, it is Wednesday. I Seriously, when you said I was like, is it? I don't know. I know. Can I give you a compliment about your dress? Because I love it. This? Yes, or oh. your, your top. What I, do you call that? Well, it is a dress, but it's really short, so I made it a top. I love it Thank because you. it makes me want to peep right now. Peep? An Easter peep. You know the oh. peep? <laughs> What do you mean you want to beep? No. I don't know what that means. A peep. You want a, an Easter, an Easter peep. marshmallow peep. Got it. Oh, Maddie, I'm so sorry. I got it. What did I say? <laughs> right before we came on, I told Maddie, I was like, I am so tired. I got no sleep last night because of the thunder and lightning storms. Yeah. And my dog was like walking all over me, unsettled Mika. He's the one that hates the storm. And I'm like, yeah. I just, I'm, I'm out of it today, so I'm sorry. I didn't I, even know there was a storm last night, so, and I'm sorry, I don't mean to say that to rub it in your no. face, but like, I had no idea there was rain coming out of the sky, there was no. lightning, electrifying. And I watered all my plants yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna be real hydrated, okay? They are like, we are good to go. We're good to go, Dad. We're no good more. To go. Don't drown us, please. <laughs> Sorry. What I was meaning to say is I love your top because it's Thank purpley, you. good, deliciousness, like a little marshmallow peep, and I, I know. love it. I feel like. It makes me hungry. I don't even know, I just feel like, Little Miss Muffet, I'm sitting on my tuffet. Or like big old. Oh, <laughs> I need curds and whey right now. Ah, uh, well, let me go get that for you. <laughs> also, Maddie, you know, makes me think of a little Moira Rose a little bit. A little Moira. I'm, I'm always trying to like get this. I love sleeves. Moira. Yes. <laughs> oh, I wish I could talk like her. I can't. I, all do I can it. say is you fold, fold in the cheese, David. What do like, you mean? <laughs> What you just folded in? Did you see the Halloween thing I sent you where the two things were doing that whole routine? Uh, it was a ghost and a pumpkin doing the whole thing yes, in the yes, cheese. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> well, that oh my God, it's a, it's a, I'm sorry, what Jake did, what did you just say? Okay, so S Creek is a show that Maddie and I love with yes. Catherine O'Hara and Dan um, Levy, Levy. Eugene Levy. Yeah. S Creek. Um, they have a joke about they don't, they're making a family recipe and it says fold in the cheese and they both don't understand what fold in the cheese means. Stop. So they're pawning it off on each other going, you fold in the cheese. What does that mean? It's yeah, so funny. It's great. It's great. But yes. And Jeremy and I send so many different things on so many different platforms. Like this morning I was looking for a recipe and I had to go, I think, through four different apps to find. I was like, was it our messages? Was yeah. it our Facebook? Was it our TikTok? Oh, it was our Instagram. <laughs> like we're always sending things. So seriously, like it's I will say, I'm like, we do have several platforms. We keep sending stuff. And I know. I'm like, and then I can't ever find it. <laughs> can't find it. Can't remember it. And Maddie's made a list. And I, I, I still can't even stick to the list. <laughs> it's like. There's so many things that pop up. It pop. Yeah. Anyway, we have so many great ideas, guys. We just have to implement I know. them. I must have been really hungry when I went to bed last night because I was sending you all food stuff. Oh. Well, I, I made a crazy recipe last night. I just put <laughs> chicken breasts in a pan with cream of chicken soup. Okay. And then I mixed in a frozen bag of peas and carrots and onion. <laughs> okay. And then mixed it and plopped it on and baked it. I was like, I, I'm out of ideas, guys, for Did dinner. Did you add cheese to it? No cheese. It was pretty good. It kind of tasted like Thanksgiving a little bit. It just kind of sounds like it. It's a little Thanksgiving with a salad, though, because well, you know we've been craving salads. Yes, salads on salads on salads. Are you guys big salad people? I am, especially in the summertime. You can't go wrong with a good crisp salad. Mm -hmm. Ugh, chopped mm -hmm. salad. Just so refreshing. A good strawberry salad with some chicken on there. You can never Caesar go wrong. Man. A Caesar man. Oh, yeah. You can never go wrong with Caesar, too. Yeah. I agree. You know, a little chicken Caesar. Dare I say, Angela, I'm loving your outfit, too. It reminds me of peeps yeah. as well. A little pink An peep. Easter theme. Easter theme. I just yes. love it. Yes. Mr. I love spring and, and I've got a right. pop of color. Purple, there we go. I do. I'm yeah. kind of boring. Uh, no, you're not, okay. Jesse. You're, you're, you're red for the Chiefs. Chiefs. It's Red yes, Wednesday yes. in Kansas City. Sure, yeah. They're, uh, yeah. yeah, I'm like just mentally preparing myself <clears throat> for tomorrow. Jesse, um, I can already see the stress <laughs> in your face, my friend. Guys, I'm freaking <laughs> out, okay? I um, see it. Hey, Travis Kelsey's okay. He's got a bone so bruise. He can breathe. Okay. Um, <coughs> yeah, I, it's just I have the jitters every time uh, the week one every year. I just have the, the, the heebie jeebs. And uh, yeah. Quick, so. quick question, fellas, friends, Maddie, everyone. Mm -hmm. How red are we going tomorrow? How red should we go? This will be my first one, so I cannot comment. How red? Are, I mean, <laughs> wow. Are you what a PR on? answer that was. <laughs> I, know that one. I uh, refuse to comment. Very. Thank you. <laughs> Maddie's I ready for president. Uh, <laughs> Do we go like face paint, body yeah, paint? Sure. Yeah, sure. No. I'm gonna go 
I'll probably go like either gray or tan suit tomorrow with a red tie. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I don't. I can't quite go full Ronald McDonald for the uh, <laughs> for the newscast. Okay. Um, as much as I'd love to, I cannot. But uh, okay. yeah, you know, I keep it subtle. I say I got like a good red dress planned, and then I forgot I actually have some really cool red heels. So that could be a possibility. Boom. Okay. okay. They could Do it be all. lucky heels for the Just Chiefs. Just checking. So she gets it, folks. <laughs> as a Cowboys fan, I'll still go all out for the Chiefs. The Chiefs that's, are my second favorite. See, but okay. that's the thing, Angela. We're right there. The Cowboys exactly. and the Chiefs mm -hmm. are my top two. Yes, are. Exactly. I love whenever they yeah. get the chance to play each other. Mm -hmm. It's just, you know, I'm yeah. like, I just hope everyone has fun at that point. <laughs> everyone know, gets Can't we all just get along? <laughs> <laughs> High fives all around. Right. Yes. Anticipation, <laughs> trophy, it's ribbon. It's very yeah. rare when they get to play each other, but yeah, they do. Kind of, uh, pretty cool. When your two favorite teams play each other, it kind of puts you in a pickle. It yeah. does. It really does. Yeah. Thank you, Jake. Ooh. Is that a segue? Did I oh, I like it was. that. Okay. Let's see what you did there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We're talking about pickles now, okay? I love pickles. We're talking about pickles now. <laughs> All right? Big a hard segue. Here. All right. Starting off here, uh, pickles specifically in one generation are ga uh, gaining a lot of love among. And uh, Jeremy, this goes back, and Maddie, this goes back to a conversation that you guys had last week, I think. Gen Z thinks they discovered everything. Oh. <laughs> oh. They really do, though. What? Pickles are very popular amongst Gen Zers right now. On TikTok, videos related to pickles or a hashtag connected to them have a combined 10 billion views. A few reasons they're going viral. Pickles are often part of the quote-unquote girl dinner trend and the hot pickle challenge. Another is that some prefer drinking pickle juice straight from the jar. Right. Oh, yeah. That's been around forever. One trend experts say that pickles are, uh, experts are saying that pickles are to Gen Z what avocados were. To <laughs> Honestly? <laughs> I agree. So I'm a zennial. That's what we were talking about since I'm 95. But I equally love both. I go nuts about avocados and pickles. I remember oh. when avocados were the thing. And so we were, I, I get that. Millennials yeah. were like, you can't afford a house because you're buying avocado toast. That's right. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> that was the thing. I was so. like, you can make your own avocado toast. Yeah, yeah it's just not as good. It isn't. I like it when it's so nice good. and fresh so you can just order it. Yeah. But can you believe it, guys? Pickles, brand new concept. Wow. I what, like it. What Thanks, is the Lindsay. hot girl dinner trend? Or oh, dinner um, girl yes. dinner. So girl dinner, it's kind of like a bunch of... <laughs> I, I, hot girl summer, hot girl dinner. Combine no, no, it's okay. I love it. So love girl it. dinner is kind of... I don't know what the hot pickle challenge is. I'm, I don't know. I know that one. But like the girl dinner, though, is just kind of like a bunch of like sides. I think, is it Popeyes who actually has... A girl oh, a dinner platter. meal where it's literally just mac and cheese, mashed potatoes, little French fries, kind of like sides. a smorgasbord. It's sides. basically sides, like I little, have been it's like snacks, on this trend. like yeah. little yeah. snacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For dinner, okay, girl so. dinner. Yeah. Jesse and Angela, by the way, you are on top of the trends because I was going through yes. TikTok. Uh -huh. Like you guys are on it. Gen Z and the silent I, walking we did last week. Yes, oh, silent that's right. walking. That was. I was it. going I through TikTok. I still don't get that one. I was yeah. going through TikTok and this girl, <laughs> seriously, as serious as could be, was on this podcast talking. She goes, "Yeah." I went on a silent walk. Was yesterday. it Bobby Bobby oh. Altoff? Is that who it was? I don't remember. Okay. But oh, like, podcast host? Yeah. yeah. I was dying laughing because she was taking it so seriously. I'm like, you've like, got to get a grip. Girl, come I'm on. I'm going to show you a picture of Bobby Altoff, and I want you to tell me if it was that girl. Okay, I will. Okay. She was dead serious, yeah, yeah, yeah. Maddie. Yeah. She was like, uh, oh, I... I can believe while it. um yeah, while we think about that, let's let's go on to the, the next, next one. one. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. we have a nice little a hundred year old pet tortoise went on an afternoon adventure after escaping its yard in Louisiana. Mm. Properly named Biscuit, an African tortoise, <gasps> was rescued by animal control officers and deputies yeah. from the Ascension Parish Sheriff's Office after he was found in distress near Canal. Now he was found the same day he left the backyard, so of course. He clearly didn't make it that far. Oh. The tortoise escaped through a broken gate in the owner's yard that had been damaged during a storm. The owner didn't even know Biscuit had escaped until its co-worker showed him photos that were posted by local officials on social oh. media. Yeah. In this footage, Biscuit is striding out the doors of the shelter toward his owner's car, knowing it's time to go home. It's like so sweet. Jeremy to the dogs when you let them out, and they're ready. I don't know how often they get car rides, but. You know, are they just ready to jump in the car? Yes, I can see the tortoise. So yes. Like, okay. The tortoise has a little <laughs> Get up in the there. shell yeah, waddles. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's so they, true, though. Yes. That is the, and I'm like, no, not right now, because they get confused. Like, I'm just going to the garage right now. Yes. <laughs> yes they get, now getting in the, right in the car. Yeah. My favorite's the head tilts. Are you going to oh, go yeah. bye-bye? Bye. -bye? bye. <laughs> yeah, they get so excited. Tortoise. Yes.
I love it. Also, the ease with which that man just picked up the tortoise. That oh thing looks like it weighs 100 drop years old, 100 on pounds. My foot and like break my foot. Yeah. No he was fear. just like, Oh gosh, I love that story. I love it. Oh, sweet, me too. Yeah. Mm -hmm.